Hi all and welcome to Parker's Reefs. In today's episode, we're going to start off my Queensland local fish shop crawl. We're going to start off with Guppy's Aquarium products online. Whilst they're an online store, they also have a store that you can visit in person. Alright, so let's kick things off. Now, Guppy's Aquarium products are located down south. When I say down south, south from Brisbane. So we're actually a little bit south of uh, the Gold Coast, you can see on the map there. So it was a little bit of a drive, but uh, the guys there were more than welcome, uh, welcoming to have us come in and have a look around. So uh, let's uh, not delay and show you the uh, products they got on hand. So you might recognize the logo. Their uh, website's quite prominent. You've probably seen it online, and Guppy's are known as having uh, the best prices around. So. When you're shopping for things online, it's normally a, um, a place that uh, everyone's familiar with. But like I said, they do also have a, um, whilst there's a warehouse, they do actually have a functioning retail store and you can go in and pick stuff up yourself. <laughs> you see uh, Zach and um, the store owner there who uh, wishes to remain uh, fairly uh, unanimous. So uh, <laughs> let's continue on. And when I say Zach, he's uh, the man behind Yellow Marine. So i um, give you his product a quick plug there and uh, we'll scroll on to see the other products they've got. So we've got a um, good freezer full of uh, food there and a bunch of the um, NEM Protects, which are a product that I will be uh, reviewing sometime soon, give myself a quick wave in the reflection. And um, you can see the, the, the theme of um, Guppies here is, like I said, it is a warehouse. They do predominantly focus on their online sales, but they figure there's no point uh, closing the door and uh, forcing you to post things when you can come in to pick it up if you're local. So they've got a huge range of products on the shelf here. Um, and it's it's all laid out. So I'm not going to try and name every single product on the shelf because um, this video would probably go for about eight hours. But uh, to keep things reasonable, I'm going to scroll through and pick out some of the things that um, I recognize as we go. So you can see um, some of the high-end products there. You've got your Radians, your AI Primes, um, a good range of the foods all here. Uh, they're the... Uh, mostly, yeah, they're marine and freshwater foods there. You can just see to the right there, lots of different buckets of salt. Um, some more yellow marine glue. Looks like down here we've got uh, predominantly all their pumps. So we've got uh, some Ecotech uh, pumps there. We've got some uh, Gaia's. We've got some Waveline pumps. We've got uh, Rossmont movers. We've got some uh, cheaper alternatives. We've got some, I think they are Merlin pumps by the looks. Uh, you can see some chillers stacked up behind there. Being winter, they're probably uh, easy to put things in front of at the moment because they're not that popular. Um, summer comes around, they will be. Um, this is the first place I've seen the uh, Walt Smith uh, Reef Rock 2.1 on the shelf, and uh, they had a heap of it there, including these Halia pumps. Uh, what else we got? I'll get as far down there as I can. We've got a bunch of Tunzi pumps. Um, a whole heap of um, T5 bulbs there. This is a brand new shipment of the uh, Reef Antibiotics range, um, which uh, we'll get to see a little bit more of a bit later. And here's some of the skimmers they got on hand. Um, you can see actually they've got some tanks up there too. <laughs> you gotta love putting the tanks on the highest shelf, but I'm sure there's um, good logic behind that. Um, the guys here have got forklifts to get everything in and out, so it does make sense. It just uh, makes me nervous, I guess. Uh, looking at the range of skimmers, we've got Bubble Magus, we've got the Great White, uh, some different size Bubble Magus, looks like a uh, Marine Sources. Uh, what do we got here? Some Nios, the Red Sea Reefer. Uh, looks like we got um, a few different air pumps there, um, usually more common with freshwater, but they do also have um, some purposes in the Marine. And here are the guys checking out a uh, said range of uh, new, free, new reef antibiotics. <laughs> with our unanimous owner uh, laying low behind the uh, product there and uh, you can see this is their um, yeah their brand new range of um, uh, elk and calcium and uh, all, all the other additives um, they come in a powdered form which makes it significantly more um, uh, affordable and uh, yeah we're looking forward to see some more of that range soon but uh, that, that literally is the shipment that just came into the country so um, can't give away too many details on that just yet just walk past the Hikari Foods and uh, I just wanted to check out these, uh, these nifty little displays for some dead corals. Um, looks like they've been there for a little while, but um, they're obviously um, uh, something that someone's put a little bit of effort into. And uh, it's a good way to get some use out of uh, any corals that don't, un or unfortunately don't make it. You see a whole range of uh, air stones there. Can be handy for uh, quarantine setups. And a good range of salts. You've got uh, Red Sea, you've got uh, Tropic Marin, we've got Aquarium Systems, we've got Blue Treasure. Um, yeah, quite a, quite a variety of salts. And uh, what do we got here? Starting to get onto some uh, some more supplements, uh, different ranges of supplements there. 
um, some more gravels for freshwater systems, a huge assortment here of uh, lighting ranging from PAR 38 bulbs up to uh, ATI um, T5s here, ATI bulbs in all of the colours in all of the wattages, so uh, if you're looking for ATI bulbs, you've also got the um, Corellan bulbs there, which are quite a popular bulb but oh, i should say they're quite a high quality bulb but not that popular in australia probably just because you don't normally find them on the shelf but uh now that we know guppies have them could be a good option uh you got geesman lights there as well and uh solar max a bit of a cheaper option there a few more uh, atis down there i believe let's see what else we can find all right we've got uh looks like some pond foods i think Oh yeah, they're pallets here, micro lift pallets. Um, what's down in here? Our filter socks, big assortment of filter socks in different uh, materials, different microns, different sizes. And uh, here we've got um, a big range of glues and uh, plugs and tiles. So we've got Ocean Wonders um, tiles. There's a big range of different uh, coral sands in there. Uh, we've got uh, the Seachem uh, epoxy glues there. You've got the Aquaforest large plugs. We've got some uh, different gel glues. So we've got bubble magus and uh, marine source doses. We've got uh, the Aqua One filter socks, uh, the Kamoa range of dosing pumps, including the Kamoa X1 and X4, or F4X, I think it is, sorry. Um, a huge range of Ocean Wonders plugs there. And they also have these really nice large tiles that I just picked up. Um, there's our uh, yellow marine, our favorite glue. And uh, we've got some real reef rock up there, some plush uh, toys, looks like some uh, bristle noses there. We've also got uh, real reef rock, we've got the um, stacks um, on top of the um, the Walt Smith varieties as well. So the guys here have got a huge range, um, including your shelves, your branching, um, rock, big range of rock, um, dry rock ready to ship out to you. We've got the uh, full range of the tropical dry foods, including both the marine and the um, dry variants there. Um, come along here you see some of the uh, display tanks they have so we've got a couple we've got ooh, it's a bit of a spoiler alert but um, guppies don't just have dry goods they do actually have a uh, wet room with fish and coral for sale they don't ship these items but um, it, it's good for local customers to be able to come in and take advantage of the cheapest prices going as well as pick up some uh, fish and coral a couple of display tanks there just set up to give people inspiration and then we've got uh, yet more range of products. It, um, it really is a warehouse and it has so much stuff here, it's um, hard to believe. So we've got a range of different brands of carbon there. Um, we've got some more micro, uh, micro lift products there, including some elk buffers. I'm gonna try and scroll through these pretty quickly because um, it, it almost never ends and um, I don't wanna overstay my welcome. So I'm scrolling through to see as much as we can. We've got some calcium reactor media there from Arm. Uh, what do we got up here? Apologies, this uh, aisle's quite tight, so I'm doing my best to fit down here with the camera. You can see it uh, barely fits uh, my rear end in there. We've got a um, huge range of the Laguna pumps, which are really popular. They're known as being uh, absolutely bulletproof. And uh, we haven't got some uh, fish in here. We've got uh, some of their smaller items. So we've got, uh, looks like some uh, damsels there. And then uh, hiding down in the uh, sump down here is a beautiful Sohole. He's an absolute monster, big fish, happy and healthy, just looks um, a treat. There's a trigger swimming in down there with him. And then, uh, yeah, what else we got up here? Well, I'll just pan the camera back down. We got uh, some clownfish um, and we said some damsels. Uh, let's see what we got over here. There's another uh, display set up there just with some uh, fake corals, if that's um, the way you want to go. You see a beautiful wrasse there, um, some more exotic clowns, which are uh, quite nice variants there. I apologize, I can't um, tell you what type of clowns they are. They're predominantly white, but um, not completely white. I uh, see some chromus up in there, some uh, look like some tomato clowns. Another quick look at this so whole because um, he's big enough to eat. He is an absolute beauty. Makes that trigger and that uh, sump there look pretty small, but uh, I can assure you he's not small. All right, quick more products along here. We've got a huge range of the Eheim products here. So ranging from their uh, canister filters through to uh, their lights, um, their pumps, and we see a bit more of the Aqua One range down here. You see some more dry tanks getting set up. And uh, over to the right here, there's some freshwater fish. I'm not gonna give you too much of an overview of those because uh, you're probably not that interested. Plus I couldn't tell you what they are. 
Um, you've got a good range of different hosing, <clears throat> hosing there sold by the meter, which is um, very handy to have because it's a proper aquarium hose. It's not going to get that slime like your uh, Bunnings ones will. And we've got the full range of the Waypro controllers here from the uh, pH controller, the pH and ORP, just the ORP, conductivity um, controller and more. But uh, as I did let on a little bit earlier, oh, before we jump in there, we've got the uh, Aquaforest range here. Also got the um, Bryopsis Buster Pills there, Reef Antibiotics and uh, some Mastic products as well. So there's, that's a quality shelf of products there and um, the Aquaforest stuff goes around the corner. But uh, as I did uh, let on, there is a, um, a livestock room here at Guppies. It's not just a warehouse and they do have, uh, while well, well, some freshwater things, but they've also got some uh, marine items as well. So we're just going to scoot past the freshwater stuff and let's get into these marines. Have a look at that clown. He's an absolute stunner, the colouring on that guy. Just uh, beautiful gold colouring, and uh, he's happy there in his nem. Got some more clowns there. A little baby sailfin. Uh, we've got some snails down in here. We've got some uh, gobies. Uh, more clowns. Looks like a little uh, Helfrichy goby, maybe, in the back of there. A goby of some sort. We've got uh, big rats in there. He's uh, pacing around. He looks he looks edgy, those rats. Um, looks like a queen angel, perhaps. Uh, lovely one-spot fox face there. Some beautiful butterflies. Look just ready to munch your coral, but um, stunning little guys. And I think that could be a conspicuous in the background there. Really nice fish. Um, we've got a harlequin tusk. We've got a um, really cool trigger, and I apologize. I cannot remember the name of this guy, but he is um, fairly rare, and I haven't seen him before, hence why the name slips my uh, mind. Got um, a big sand sifting goby in there, as long as um, so, uh, some naso tangs. And uh, here's uh, their uh, coral display, well, not display, sorry, their coral tub, which all of these items are for sale. Um, we've got a cool assortment here, ranging from um, scollies to uh, helios to lobos, um, acans. You name it, they've got it in there, and um, it flows on down here. What do we got? We got this is a bit more of a softy section in here, plus some LPS. Um, good assortment of uh, corals here, which, um, yeah, I was not expecting at all. I was expecting that we we're going to be uh, going for a tour around a warehouse, and uh, little did I know we're going to see some uh, fishing corals that are available for sale as well. So they've got a beautiful range of cinarias in there, um, cinularia, sorry, um, and some other softies. They've got some nice hammers there, quite large pieces if um, you're looking for something to fill a big gap, some turbinarias, um, really cool setup. Like I said, completely unexpected, and um, I did just want to point out, um, speaking to the owner, they do not ship live goods. That is for local customers only, so uh, if you don't live in Queensland, you can only take advantage of their top prices online. We can't um, ship those products, but still amazing if you are local or if you're on holidays in Queensland. Um, these guys are right on the Gold Coast. Check in and um, see the stuff they've got there. Now, just before we jump into the uh, secret room at the back to show you one more thing, just a quick look at those plush toys and uh, let's have a look in this uh, back room because I was just about to leave when uh, the owner said, I haven't shown you the uh, plumbing room. So the guys took me out the back and I apologize for the quality of the footage because it's quite dark back here, but they've got a full range of the um, American size plumbing here. So the Schedule 40, Schedule 80 type plumbing here, which is quite common in um, a lot of the all-in-one tanks we get at the moment. I want to say all-in-one, like the pre-made tanks. So your Cades, um, your Red Seas, uh, possibly your water box, I'm not sure. All of their plumbing comes with uh, fittings that are not um, Australian sized plumbing, which can be an absolute nightmare when you go to customize it. Never fear, guppies have got you covered. They've got a full range here. They've got uh, gate valves, ball valves, elbows, piping, um, unions, you name it, they've got it here. A huge range. Um, we're only seeing a fraction of it because um, yeah, my good friend Zach and I have uh, pushed our way out the back and uh, having a look around here and it's not really a space that's uh, suited for three people. But um, yeah, there's a full range of pieces in there. Now, one last thing I wanted to show you just before we close out this video, um, because I recognize we've gone for 14 minutes so far, is all of that range of um, artificial rock that I showed you in store. The guys here at Guppies actually cure that for you. So they've got a tank out the front here that they um, cure the rock in. They have it in there going, running through natural salt water flowing through. They've got uh, full filtration on it. And they've got all of this rock out here set up so that it will naturally cure for you. So if you want to set up a tank, you can without having to wait. Now, the best thing about this is they don't charge any more for that. It's the same as the dry price. So you'd be crazy not to take advantage of it. 
Anyway, guys, I've got to uh, sign off now because you probably had enough of this video. If you've enjoyed it, be sure to like it, comment below. Um, I've got a heap more coming in the Queensland local fish shop tour, so uh, be sure to hit subscribe and hit the uh, bell notification so you don't miss those videos. And until next time, thanks. Bye.